everyone, it's Mr. Josh. Hope you had an amazing week and are ready for another exciting lesson for Sunday School. So this week we're talking about two brothers. Do you have a brother? Cool. How about a sister? Oh, maybe. And if you don't have a brother or a sister, do you maybe have a friend? Yeah, we all have friends. In today's Bible lesson, two brothers, one named Jacob and one named Esau, have been fighting for a long time because they want to be the head of the household, meaning they get all the property and all the things once their father is too old and has to retire. And they kind of change over time. Sometimes that happens. People change over time and they're not how we remember them. In our video today, Gabe's cousin Abe is coming over to for a visit. But Gabe finds out that Abe is a little different than he remembers. Let's watch and find out what happens. Hey, Leo. Hello, Gabe. Hey, can I borrow one of your copters? Sure. What for? I want it for when my cousin Abe comes to visit. Your cousin Abe? The one who you visited a few years ago, whom you called the greatest cousin in the world? Yep, he really is. It's like we have the same brain. <laughs> <laughs> we love all the same activities. <clears throat> We're both an only child. He's like the brother I never had. You're very fortunate to have him. I am. Having Abe as my cousin is such a blessing. And now he's coming to live with me for three weeks while his parents are taking a second honeymoon. Three weeks, huh? That's a long time. I know. We're going to share a room and do all kinds of stuff. It's going to be even better than the last time I saw him. Have you ever shared a room before? Never. I see. Well, here's the copter. Thanks, Leo. Abe is gonna love it. I can't wait to have Abe back. We'll make so many more memories. <coughs> Abe! Good to see you! Wow, you got tall. I had a growth spurt. Last year I grew five inches and three shoe sizes. I see you have birds. Yeah, I prefer their company. They don't judge me. Huh. Uh, what you playing? Sweet Smasher. Well, let's get you moved in. You can put the birds in the living room, I guess. Uh, the birds sleep in the same room as me? Here, Leo. I don't think I'll be needing this. Oh? Are things not going well with Abe? Well, I don't know. Last time I saw him, he was a kid like us. Now he's some weird, mopey teenager. Thirteen is a tumultuous age. It was so easy before. Now it's just really hard. So much for being a blessing. Hmm. Gabe, do you know why I built a laboratory in the sub-basement of the church? Because you're going for that mad scientist thing? No, to have some personal space. I love my siblings, and I'm blessed to have them in my life. But that doesn't mean it's easy. Sometimes it's downright annoying. That's just how some blessings are. They're hard work, they're challenging, and they're completely worth it. But I don't even know where to start with Abe. Just give yourself some time to reconnect. Find some common ground. Like our mustaches? You have a mustache? I'm working on it.
Oh, so you know what? Even though Abe was a lot different than Gabe remembered, and they didn't get along at first, they still found a way to work together and to have a good time together. Okay? So if that happens to you, if maybe one day you grow apart from a friend or a brother or sister, I'm sure you can still find some really cool ways to work together and to have fun. You know, question for you. Where are all of these stories coming from? You're right, the Bible. And how do we spell Bible? Hmm. B -b Bible. B B I B L E. Ah, B I B L E. <laughs> now that's the book for me. Let's sing the song B I B L E. Over there, standing by the mailbox. Hey, Courtney, what are you doing, standing by that big old blue mailbox? I'm ready for the mail and to bring you a very special letter. Huh? Well, what kind of letter, Courtney? I pray for a letter from God. <laughs> but Courtney, you already have a letter from God. I do. Yeah, it's called the Bible. Wow, I'm gonna go read this letter right now. Yeah, I think that's a pretty good idea. I think I'll go read it, too. See you in a little bit. Bye-bye, Gilbert. See you in a minute. Beautiful singing as always. Thanks for tuning in this week. I hope you have an amazing week and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.